Oklahoma City City. So again, for this problem, like I said, we're just at 3 pi over 8 equals u over 2. Let's go ahead and evaluate for u over 2. So we know u over 2 is equal to 3 pi over 8. We've done this already. So we know that when multiplying by 2 on both sides, that we have u equals 3 pi over 4. Right? OK, now for tangent, we're not really concerned about, because we don't have a square root, plus or minus, so we don't have to worry about that. Um, and then we need to evaluate for the tangent at 3, 5, or 4. So again, we go to our unit circle. And we say, all right, 3, 5, or 4 is right here on the unit circle. That's negative square root of 2 over 2, comma square root of 2 over 2. All right, so now we know what our cosine and our sine coordinates are. Hello. Yes, I did. It's um, back over there, and I'll be with and I'll be with you just a second. It's right under those uh, Manila folders. Okay, thank you. Um, so here we have this point right here. So all it's asking us to do is say, well, what's the cosine of u? Negative. So it's negative square root of two. So you do one minus um, negative square root of two over two divided. Plus. Well, I'll get into the yeah. It will be plus, but I'm just going to write it out just so we don't not to go too many steps at a time. And then sine of u, which is square root of 2 over 2. Unfortunately, we can't cancel them out because this needs to divide into both terms. So, but let's go back to what we've done every single time when we have fractions in our numerator and denominator. Got to get rid of them, right? Well, you could, um, we could multiply that through, right? Let's just multiply, let's get this off the denominator. How about we multiply, eh. Let's get the, yeah, let's multiply by the reciprocal. Yep. So, yes, but I interpreted her saying, can these just cancel out and be left with one? So now let's go ahead and distribute. So 2 times 1 is going to leave you with 2 over square root of 2. And then plus, these are going to cancel out. So that would just be cancel out or divide into 1. Um, now what we can do is uh, rationalize our denominator. Ooh, I can see why. So therefore, I have 2 square root of 2 over 2 plus 1. Of what? Yeah, this is like one over one. Yeah, it's over one. Yeah, it's over. Yeah, it's over one. Everything's over one. Okay, that's it. I'm done. Sorry, guys. I had to answer.